welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to play with Star Wars and I'm going to try and do um, a dead star from Star Wars um, using leftover wood. So let's start playing with it. Thank you for joining me. Let's have some fun. I'm going to, I'm going to join those pieces of wood together and uh, it's going to be six of them and I'm going to cut, uh, glue them together and then left, leave them overnight then cut them with the slats like the pieces that missing on the dead star and that's the idea behind it and then I'm going to put some resin and let's see how it looks like um, and of course um, thank you for coming back to my channel and don't forget to subscribe and to leave comments at the bottom and like my channel I'm going to create a sphere that looks like the dead star. Um, I'm not going to use a jig uh, for two reasons. Uh, you need a little bit of hands free playing and then I don't have a jig. <laughs> If you have a look um, at the dead star on the Star Wars, you will see it's, got, it's, it's like been broken, it's been exploded, or they start building it, and you will see there is sluts over there, and that's what I'm trying to do with those cuts that I'm doing at the moment. Creating a vessel for the, for the resin that I'm going to use, it, th this, this one will be a, a very short video. It's, um, it's shorter than my normal videos. Um, that's how it came out. Uh, usually I've got a 15 minutes video. This one will be about 12 or 12 and a half minutes video. Uh, enjoy it. The resin that I'm using is uh, resin for art that I bring from the UK. Uh, and um, I would have been able to, without uh, breaking anything or without cutting anything, by the way. The beginning I'm putting it between two centers but the, but then the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to create a tenant so it will be much much easier it will it will sit stronger and um, by any chance if the glue that I put wasn't glue wasn't good it will not fly on me and and, and um, break off. As usual, I'm using carbine tools, uh, and on this project, I'm using the black line tools, um, like this one, like the black line parting tool. It's unbelievable, easy to work with. I'm going to mount it back uh, on my um, on my lathe, and I'm um, going to use it uh, on on the um, tenant. The small uh, white pellet that you see I'm using, it's, it's, 
I created um, half a um, sphere and I'm slowly slowly creating the sphere according to the template that I made so I'll get as close as possible to the size of the sphere and here I'm using um, from the black line I'm using the V or the triangle uh, carbine that, that's back again to the to the round one um, just to clean up and it works like a very nice scraper I made another jig. You will see it a little bit later. It's not a jig. It's an it's an a vacuum um, vacuum um, chuck that works on spheres. Quite interesting one. It works nice, uh, but you can't use a lot of force. Um, so stick around. You'll see it. Uh, it's quite a nice one. Now I'm starting with. Um, with sandpaper from 180 all the way to um, 400. From there, I'm moving to um, water pads, uh, medium, uh, fine, uh, super fine, uh, micro fine, and then I'm going to use Yorkshire. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm going to use uh, Novas 3.2, and um, for the wood, I'm going to use um, I'm going to use OB Shanjos. Slowly, slowly, you see how clear it's getting, and uh, now you'll see even more when I add the the um, shine juice. I made this um, vacuum chuck from an old piece of leftover of resin that I had. I don't throw resin at all. Um, I mounted it on a, a drilled and I made a trade for the for the lathe. And I put inside, I made a groove and I put inside um, a rubber um, oil ring. The only thing with that you have to be very, 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 very soft and otherwise it will definitely jump out.
On this side, just because I've got only wood, no resin, I can uh, put the Yorkshire grid, I can send it and all the way to 600 and then put Yorkshire grid and then Obi Shanjos. A small drill that's like the window that comes or the uh, the the gate that goes onto the onto onto the dead star. I hope you enjoyed this fun project with me. Um, I hope you'll uh, subscribe and uh, make give me some comments. And I'm thanking you for looking at this video. Cheers.